and welcome back to The Whistle. This is season three, episode five, with Coach Pollock and Coach Hart, The Whistle. Episode five, baby. Well, Coach, I tell you what, episode man, we, uh, we are, um, we got sort of a spring practice today. We did. And uh, everything went great um, on our side of the ball. I thought our kids had a lot of energy. We come out the snow days, yeah, they're going uh, Snowzilla 24. <laughs> Here, yeah, here in Colorado, about four feet of snow. I've never seen so much snow in my life. That so, was crazy. Man. I have my kids down here, too, for spring yeah. break. And so I thought it was going to be fun because, you know, we're from Texas. We've yeah. never seen snow. So I was like, hey, you got snow coming. Really? So they, all that night, they were looking. <laughs> when is snow coming, Dad? When is snow coming? <laughs> snow wasn't coming. About, what, 9, 30, 10 o'clock, yeah. maybe? Yeah, yeah. 9, 30, yeah. 10, I started falling. I said, oh. Yeah. I woke them up. They was, oh, daddy, look at the snow. Oh, and so on. About 7, 8 o'clock that morning, I looked out. I got a little word. I said, this snow still coming. And it's, no, it's coming hard, too. Hey, listen. Oh, I was sitting there, and um, I was looking at night like you were waiting for the snow to come in. And I dozed off. And then I woke, and it was raining. And I dozed off. And I got up a little later that night. And I looked out there. I said, dang, gum, this thing come down. And then the next morning, I get to watching Fox 31 and Channel 12, channel, all the channels here in Denver to get the, the, the latest snow um, stuff. And uh, the, the, one of the weather ladies said, you need to go out there and clean the snow off your truck now. Hmm. So I went out there and cleaned the snow off my truck. Luckily, I did because, like you said, it snowed all that day. All last night, I got back up, up there. There was twice as much snow the next morning on it my was. truck. I don't, know what, I, don't, I don't know how they got all snow on I tell you what they do a good job of though, probably Coach Pilot. They, they got them roads clean now. Oh, when I, I thought it was going to be good, and them roads look good, man. Were, they, the roads was good, and then I took my kids, y'all. Check this out now. Three Texonians, all right, all right. We're down in uh, with the Bodarians, okay, on the on the on the on a hill. Oh, okay. With snow. And I got them a sled from uh, Safeway. There you go. I bought them a little sled, a little, little red sled from Safeway, a little two-seater. And they got this thing. Let me tell you who was out there. We had snowboarders. It was uh, skiers. It was a canoe out there. <laughs> it was deep enough for a canoe. canoe. It was a canoe. <laughs> and they were, they were going down this thing, man, this man. hill. And all me and my kids had a, had a time of their life in the snow. Man. That's awesome, And it man. wasn't even that cold out there. That's man. awesome. Well, man, I, I got to tell you mine. I flew back in there the night before the storm, right? Weatherman said it's going to start at 9.20. I landed at 8.30. I got in the Uber at 9. 9.15, it changed from rain to snow. Oh, oh rain to snow. And it, like you said, hard. it snowed for 12 straight hours. I'm yeah, talking about just cut. At least down. that many. 12 straight hours. That's at so least crazy, that man. They said there was like 800 something flights canceled. Yeah. yeah. Then we'll do that to you now. Canceled. Yeah. Canceled. Yeah. yeah. I do that too. They, they, start changing. Listen, they, pounds, they, pounds, they, pounds. They, the funny, the funny story was there was some ladies. And it, it, I, it wasn't funny. They were stuck on I seventy in a party bus. They I had, saw them. They had yeah. gone skiing, coach. Yeah. They, they had gone skiing, on. and 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 the and the news, the news was talking to them, and 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 you know getting their story and everything, and they told they they, they said they only had one concern. They were running out of toilet paper. <laughs> oh! <laughs> they said, we warm, yeah. we we get good, got good company, yeah. but we are running out of toilet I paper. I think that's a big supply, like <laughs> Armageddon or something. Yeah. Remember we were down in Mississippi and that 100 that year storm hit? Yeah. I went to the grocery store day before all the toilet paper. You mean the ones when we were down there at the pool with the and buckets? With the buckets. Water? Oh, yeah. Yeah. See, let, let me tell you something, yeah. you folks out here. Yeah. I want y'all to understand something. Yeah. When y'all talk about coaches that have put in time, yeah. okay, we got some stories. Ain't now. no doubt. We we didn't see, <laughs> you know, we didn't bathing in swimming pool like like back That's in Rome. You remember back <laughs> yeah. in Rome in the day? <laughs> the that big old house. public <laughs> bathhouse and in that ch- yeah. yeah, we in there, you know. We were taking trash cans, getting water out the pool, going to put it in the toilet so we could flush. We could flush the toilet. <laughs> hey, the pool had dropped about five feet. <laughs> sure did. <laughs> we, we got so much water out the pool, dropped about five feet. <laughs> I don't know what their water bill was after we left. <laughs> yeah, they yeah. Had to do some yeah. Yeah. It was a problem. Mm-hmm. It, was it was a problem. problem. It was. But uh, thankfully here in Denver, we didn't have that problem, Coach. Thankfully, we wasn't out there with trash cans, scooping up water out the pool yeah. so we could flush the toilet here in Denver. So. Well, I'm learning a lot. Yeah, I'm, I'm learning a lot. My, you, know, you know, my Coloradians, y'all teaching me a lot about how y'all move around this snow now. 
It's, it's 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 pretty interesting to oh, see yeah. it. And y'all yeah. like them roads were immaculate. Yeah, man. Shout out to the road crew. They the were road good. crew, they were good. Really y'all made it. Y'all made it great. We were great. Well, coach, I tell you what, man. You know, here on the whistle, we like that. We like to keep up with current events. Yeah. And 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 one thing that is trending on social media right now is love is blind. Uh, love is before blind. It, it's season six just finished up and. Uh, Coach Pollock had never watched Love Is Blind no, before I, I before uh, this episode, this season. I ain't watched it. And uh, Coach, I, I watched it. And and you and, and did you watch? Have you watched a few episodes of it yet? Well, I need to catch up. I ain't. I'm. 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 I'm tell me about it now. Well, tell me what, what about this love. All right. So the the the, the 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 deal is is basically they get some single men and women. And the last this last one was they were in Charlotte, North Carolina, and and they get these people and they they're obviously they're single, and uh, you you. All the men are living together and all the women are living together. And then you come in what they call pods mm. and you and you can't see each other. So you talking to this this woman or this man and you're trying to get to know him. And before you can see him, you got to ask him to marry you. What? Now you you got to get engaged to see him. So I, yeah. I don't get to see my book bottle. You don't get to see your book bottle. Not without saying, will you marry me? Not without saying, will you marry me? Uncle Nick, That's you right. know about this too then? Oh, man, I love Love is Black. So this is... It's on oh, Netflix. So this is reality catfishing. Reality catfishing is what this is. And boy, let me go on tell you. On this, TV. this season here, this season here, boy named Jimmy, Jimmy got catfished worse than anybody I ever seen catfish. Cause cause I went back and watched some other seasons. I ain't watched them all, but I watched some other. So far, Jimmy has been catfished worse than anybody. Cause cause this girl Chelsea told this boy, he asked her, he said, what do you uh, What do you look like? And she said, Well, I kind of look like a celebrity. And uh, and uh, he's like, Which celebrity? And she said, uh, um, She said, She said Megan Fox. And when she said Megan Fox, I was drinking a beer and I I, I, I spit my beer out because I, I was sitting on the couch. I spit the beer. I said I said Wait a minute now. I need to go back and watch Transformers because because. She don't look like the Megan Fox I remember. So, and, but you already knew she was lying because what's the, what's the rapper, the dude that Megan Fox is married to? Uh, 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 anyway, uh, yeah. oh man, what's his dang, name? Was it MJ? MG, MG, MG Kelly, MG Kelly, MG Kelly. Yeah. Anyway, he, she she didn't say I look like Megan Fox. She said I look like MG Kelly's uh, wife. Mm. So you already knew she knew she didn't really look. Because how you gonna not remember Megan Fox? Yeah, okay, I got a name? question. I got a question. So when they're in these pods, right, and they're talking, is this like, so you just one-on-one -on -one with that person? Like that's the one person on one. that you talk to? So the whole show you just... No, that, no, you talk to different ones. Oh, you talk to different? You talk so to you, different ones. You from different, yeah. talk to yeah. different girls. Let's say it's yes. like 30 men, 30 women. You get to talk to everybody. Yeah. You get to talk to talk everybody. Then you get to narrow it down and focus. That's right. Oh, yeah. so Jimmy done narrowed it Jimmy down. Jimmy done narrowed it down. Listen. This was she done this tripped was bad. said Megan Fox and okay. Yeah, this was bad. It was, was bad. Coach. So Jimmy Jimmy done narrowed it down to Chelsea and Jessica. And oh, Chelsea and Jessica. Chelsea says she looked like Megan Fox. Jessica looks a lot more like Megan Fox than oh, Chelsea. Did. He done fumbled the hey, ball, coach. Listen, listen. He got in there, so he, he he gets in there with Jessica and he tells her, he said, uh, he said that he um she 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 like poured her heart out to him, let him read a little letter and everything, and he didn't really bite how she wanted to bite. Well, she got a little attitude with him, quick. Mm -hmm. She she told that joker when he sees her, he gonna need an epipen, <laughs> and uh and um he um I'm gonna tell you know, something now, the ones that give you them type of ultimatums that tell you that. Them be the baddies. Them the baddies. Yeah, them, the, them the booger bottles. Them the booger them bottles. Right the booger she bottles. was the baddie hard. She yeah. was the baddie. She was the baddie. You know, it, it ain't too often I talk to my TV. I talk to my TV. Oh. Yeah. I said, Jimmy, don't do it. Jimmy, don't do it. Hey, hey. Jimmy, I had, I had to. Listen. Jimmy, Jimmy picked Chelsea. 15-yard penalty. Lost a damn. <laughs> hey man, <laughs> all kind of infractions. Oh, yeah. We yeah. somebody might have got ejected on that play. Got ejected <laughs> but, on that play. But anyway, oh, uh, I gotta yeah. see this man. Jimmy, Jimmy, yeah. Jimmy messed up. And 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 what's so bad is uh, all right. So he ends up asking Chelsea to marry him, and then the boy tried to play it off. But so they get behind these curtains, and there's this big runway in between them when they gonna ask him to marry him, see each other for the first time. If Jimmy could have just peeked through that curtain and seen that silhouette. 
He'd have known he'd been catfish. He'd, been catfish. he'd have backed on that. He said, no, nah, I'm going to change my ah, mind. Leech. But he had, he had to get, he, she, he saw her, and he had to act like, you know, he had to act a certain way. He yeah. tried to save some face. And then, I, th I think I think Jimmy, I think Jimmy legitimately liked both of them. Yeah. And when he picked the wrong one and saw her, he had to say, you know what? Love is blind. Love is blind. Let me just go ahead and suck this up, because I do like her. But she don't look like Megan hey. Fox. But let me keep on going. And then, Love ain't blind. Hey, but, but then, <laughs> Love is not blind. Hey, but then, but then, Jimmy. Don't y'all Jim, believe that out hey, there? Hey, Love is hey, not blind now. Then Jimmy did what every every man would do. What's he that? went to Jessica's Instagram account to see what she looked like. Cause he still at that time he still didn't know what Jessica looked like. Yeah. Well, when he saw her, he was Jimmy wasn't feeling too good. <laughs> what? The relationship with Chelsea went down so fast after that. How did he get to how did he get to the account? I thought they was in the pods though. They was in the pods. They just want you out the pods. Yeah. You out okay. the pods. Okay, 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 yeah. okay. Once you out the pods, they give you your phone back. You get your phone back. First thing Jimmy did when he got his phone went to Instagram and looked her up. And Jessica was a baddie. I knew <laughs> she was a baddie. She was a baddie. Yeah, she was a booger. That's right. Bye. Let me right. tell you. Let me let me mm. throw something at you, mm. mm. Paul. Since you, you you've seen it, here's what I also think happened to Jimmy. Let me tell you my philosophy first. Yeah, I'd be 53 in June. Okay. Anybody I meet, they come into the table with something. Absolutely. Because they have lived anywhere from 30 to 50 years. No themselves. doubt. No doubt. When she told Jimmy she had a child. Yeah. He backed off. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he and did. I'm like, Jimmy, this Jimmy you can't, who, what you think of happen in the real man. world? You Exactly, man. You you can't let that bother you. No. Well, now, 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 let me be, let me play devil's Just daddy. one. Now, she said she had five hearts. Well, she said just one. one. I got a story for y'all, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm glad you said five. I'm glad you said that. But first, let me say this. Now, a man coming into a relationship, you got to think, okay, if she got a child, wow, I got, I got, okay, I got a, it's a package deal, so I got to win the child over in some kind okay. of way. Ain't no doubt and about then, that now. And then, and then if the if the if the dad is involved, I win him over too. Yeah. And figure out how that's gonna work. Yeah. Okay. So I went from dating one to three people. Yeah. And, but ain't but one I'm getting some booger bottom from. Ooh. <laughs> but I gotta I got I gotta take care of all three now. In their own different ways, you know there what you I'm go. saying? Nice. Now I'm gonna tell you what happened. I went to this R and B night one night. <clears throat> I ain't gonna lie to you, Nico. I had a team. Went to this R and B night in Denver. Went in there, had a good time, and I was in there, and this lady, she was older, I could tell she was older, but she came and she started talking to me, just making small talk. At first, my spider senses didn't go off. I didn't think she was trying to hit on me. I just thought she was making a conversation. Then she got more into it, like, you know, where, she, where you from? You don't sound like nobody from where around here. from him? Yeah, no. <laughs> I like your jacket. That's my favorite color. I was like, uh oh, oh, wait a minute. Here we go. I was like, all right, all right. Get old lady a shot. You know what I'm saying? I just see some, you know, you know yeah. old school, you know, ah, cougars yeah. and stuff. So I said, you know, I'm talking to her. This is what happened. To your point. Yeah. She said, oh, yeah. I'm here with my daughter. I said, your daughter? She said, no, my daughter's. Oh, yes. Daughter's. Yeah, it's her birthday. I said, yeah, oh, okay, that's good. She said, then she said, that's my daughter. There go my other daughter. There go my daughter. There go. I said, well, how many daughters you got? <laughs> and then she said, that's my daughter. That's her birthday. That's her, that's her birthday. That's her daughter right there. That's her birthday. In five of them in there. Ooh, five Lord. of them. And I thought to myself. That's a lot of winning over. <laughs> that's I thought a lot to of myself, self, you, that's, that's five, six personalities. And they all probably missed their daddy. <laughs> and I ain't the daddy. So that's gonna be that's yeah. gonna be trouble. And they grown too. Yeah, they grown. You know, so they know how to use the phone. So they, they got call, they got they attitudes too. They got yeah, attitudes too. Attitude. But as I was saying, that's, that was my point about, you know, yeah, the five. Jimmy kind of backing up a little bit. Now one chick kid, I I get y'all. I understand that. I do get it. Yeah. But, you know, you get the three to five. Listen now. Here, all I know is this. Is there there's this uh Can I there's this claim thing. I'm on my taxes. That's there's what I want. There's there's this there's this this, this graph called the Vicky Mendoza diagonal. Have you ever heard of it? I have not explained right. it to the time. The Vicky Mendoza diagonal is like this, okay? Yeah. It, it, a girl can be this hot and this crazy. Okay? okay. And there's a there's a diagonal. And as okay. long as she's above the line, you know, she's good. Okay. So if she's this crazy, she gotta be this hot. Yeah. Uh, if she's uh, this crazy, she gotta be this hot. So, uh -huh. Uh -huh. I, I think in your situation, it, it might not have been above the line. But I'm, I'm telling you, I think in Jimmy's situation, it, especially compared to what he ended up with. Well, from yeah. what y'all telling me, he's above the line. I'm gonna go see. First of all, I just want y'all to know we on the whistle. 
talking about love is blind, y'all. So understand, <laughs> coaches, we are sentimental. Yes. You know, y'all may think we hard. Yes. We, we coach hard. We watch like trashy that. TV. Yeah, we do. We <laughs> trashy watch. reality TV yeah, we watch. Yeah, <laughs> we want to calm down a little bit and take our mind off things. That's and right. See what else people are dealing with. You know, I want to see this now. I got to see what Jesse Listen, Blue. man, let me go and tell you. Hey, that's just the tip of the iceberg with all the drama in this, in this season. Yeah. I mean, it, 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 they, they had a lot more drama in this season, man. Don't even get me going on the rest of it. Could we do – you think they could do like a coach's love is blind? A coach's love is blind? Oh, just have what's on last coaches on love is blind. You think we could do that? Mm. Mm. Oh, well, actually, no, mm. he can't. I'd be he, scared. Yeah. I'd be scared. <laughs> I'd be scared to go out, go out there and put myself out. I'd be, I'd be asking questions like this. If you play football, would you be a three technique, <laughs> yeah. a linebacker, or a cornerback? Exactly. Like, do you catch the ball or block? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Which, would you be carrying the ball in your hands or would you be blocking? Mm -hmm. that, I mean, that, that, that'll that get you. Yeah. And hey. let me go on take you. Chelsea is a blocker. Oh, okay. And Jessica was a ball carrier. She was a ball carrier. <laughs> yes, okay. that's right. Ball carrier. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> she was a ball carrier. Now, now, if you were working out with Coach Mo Sims, would you be with the bigs or the skills? There that's you right. go. That's there exactly you go. Right. Or a combo. A combo. And, 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 and to combo. each his own. Some people like hey, bigs. I ain't, I ain't Some people like it. combos. I ain't hating on it. Some people like, I ain't, we not hate. Listen, we not we, hating. We ain't, we ain't body we shaming. Judging. We ain't we doing none of that. We just talking about preferences and what you might like and stuff like that. But – Anyway, when we get back next time, okay, I want to talk some football because I did some reconnaissance, and I was looking in your office trying to get some offensive plays. Yeah. But I couldn't find none. You, you had them pretty good. But I took a picture of your board, and you got some rankings. Oh, yeah, we got some top five rankings. Some top five rankings of running backs, receivers. Yeah. And, and we gonna, I want to go through that list yes, one time, talk and, about and, and we're going to see. I mean, he got some old school guys on here yeah, too, y'all. we're going to talk so about it. when we come back next time, all right, on the whistle. We're going to go through maybe one one, one episode yeah. and just look at the rankings. Yeah, that's right. And see if anybody would interject and put something Absolutely. else in there. I mean, he got some names. Absolutely. He got some people played when they had black and white teams. <laughs> I know he ain't seen him play. He's a historian, y'all. That's right. But we got to get ready to go, huh, Coach? We got to get sorry. ready to go. Hey, we got a big week of practice coming up, guys. Yes. Hey, we want y'all to stay in, stay tuned to the whistle. Stay tuned to Colorado football. It's going to be great spring. I'm we'll looking forward uh, to it. April 27th. That's the spring April game. April 27th spring game. Y'all get your tickets. Be there. Be there.